Mm. Ah! Since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? Not particularly. Listen, son, I know you got a mission. Right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? We've had this problem for months with this group of bandits. We we're getting drunk and murdering settlers. Last night, they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. Women folk then got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other kind, sir. Hey, wait up! I'm a terrible mother. Yeah. Hart, I hear you caught up with Mr. West Dickens. I did. For a man who claimed to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic has helped a great many people. It's a medical breakthrough from the East. The result of years of research. If only it could cure him of his diarrhea of the mouth. I wouldn't be so dismissive of science if I was with you. I'm just changing the past. He's no more a scientist than I am a priest. But people can spend their hard-earned money however they please. He's certainly a character, that West Dickens. I can't understand a goddamn word he said. Hey, Marshall, you see those vultures? We should check it out. Marston, Eli, go see what it is. Whoa. Ain't no survivors here, Marshal! Man, this don't look too good. Somebody was so busy killing people, they went and dropped their gun. That's how I see it. Cut, Marshal! More vultures! We best take a look, boys. Still smoking. Those scumbags must still be around. Come on. Come on, let's ride. They kind of got too far. Sons of bitches. Think you want to run a gang of outlaws, Marston? Yeah, but not like that. It wasn't our way. At least it wasn't my way. Killing and thieving's never right, boy. No matter how you dress it up. Unless it's ordered by a court of law, you mean? You know as well as I do, Marshal. One way or another, some men gotta die. Can't see a soul anywhere. This ain't right. All right, boys, let's have a look around. Shed's clear, Marshal.
There's no good reason for that to be boarded up. Break that door now. The rest of you, get your guns ready. Shed out back. Make a run for it when it's clear. John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. <laughs> you know I don't want to kill you, but I will. 
You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! Everybody, take cover! In that shed! Buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is gonna help us get to Bill. <coughs> Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Dick. Mighty kind. Fuck you! <coughs> Hog time. Let's get him to jail. What have you got for me? 